Hi, welcome to the video in which I tell you how to add um, the path variables um, for Notepad++ uh, with your bash. This is for this part. Um, if you have already added it um, uh, to your bash, uh, that's fine. Uh, but if you if you haven't have never added an environment variable before, so this uh, video is for you. So assuming you have uh, installed both uh, Git and Notepad++, uh, plus plus, um, you need to uh, go to your desktop and see um, at the desktop icon or if you remember the path uh, where you have um, installed uh, notepad plus plus so here is the path as you can see which is um, c program files notepad plus uh, plus for me so um, you can you can just copy this path and make sure you do not uh, copy this uh, uh, quotes just just the path okay and uh, then um, you can go to go to any um, any windows and um, just uh, paste it like this and um, it will take you to the folder okay just to just to double uh, double check it okay um, so this is the your exe file and this is uh, this is the path uh, you can see the path by just clicking here and you see the path again here so <clears throat> we have already copied it now what you need to do you need to go to your computer or this pc right click here click on properties go to go and click on uh, advanced uh, system um, properties uh, click on environment variables from there you come to this screen you click on path and um, you click on new and you um, you can go and put your path there what I did was I, I instead of adding new, you can I went on edit and click new. You can do it both ways. Now I have already added it here, which you can see here. I have already added it, but for you this place would be blank. Notepad plus plus. You see these are all my paths which are added. So just go ahead and paste this path here and um, uh, do an OK. I'll not do it because it's already added for me. Okay and um, there is one way to go another way to go also you can if you're on uh, windows uh, 10 you can uh, directly type environment and it will uh, take you to the um, environment variables uh, screen uh, which is the same screen uh, which i showed so there are two ways of uh, uh, going about it so once you have um, added the path here which is this one by any of the two uh, two means which um, I had uh, shown you, you have to go and um, open your uh, bash uh, screen, which is um, this one. You go here, and uh, if your if your path settings and installation is correct, you would be able to um, open it from your bash, which means you put a Notepad uh, plus plus and uh, you put an enter, and you will see a Notepad, a notepad uh, plus plus um, uh, coming in. Yeah, so uh, this is the way to do it. Uh, you need to do a couple of other tests as well to see your bash version. So um, you can take this uh, git version uh, command and uh, you can just paste, paste it and you see that we are on the latest version of uh, 2.7. Um, you can also check the uh, bash version with uh, uh, this command. So that's if if all these steps works your installations are correct and uh, it will set up uh, the precedence for all your projects that will be uploading to git github and uh, creating a wonderful uh, rocking uh, repository thank you